O oh, beloved Mother, you know so well the ways of holiness and love. Teach us to raise our minds and hearts often to the Trinity and to fix thereon our respectful and loving attention. Since you journey with us on the path of eternal life, do not be a stranger to the frail pilgrims your charity is willing to shelter. Turn your merciful gaze toward us. Draw us into your brilliance. Shower us with your kindness. Lead us into the light and into love. Lead us ever further and higher into the splendors of heaven. Let nothing ever trouble our peace, nor make us leave the thought of God. But let each minute take us further into the depths of the august mystery, until the day when our souls, fully blossomed by the light of divine union, will see all things in eternal love. Rebuild the walls of Jerusalem, 
then you will be pleased with lawful sacrifice, all of us offered on your altar. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. Jesus, Son of God, save you. Have mercy on me, a sinner. And in your life we see light. 
keep on loving those who know you, doing justice for upright thoughts. Let the foot of the proud not crush me, nor the hand of the wicked cast me out. See how the evil doers fall, flung down they shall never Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. <laughs> now that you say we see your guilt remains. Who shall I glorify your name, O Lord? Strike up the instruments, a song to my God with timbrels, chant to the Lord with cymbals, sing to him a new song, exalt and acclaim his name. A new hymn I will sing to my God, O Lord, great are you and glorious, wonderful in power and unsurpassable. Let your every creature serve you, for you spoke and they were made. You sent forth your Spirit and they were created. No one can resist your work. The mountains to their bases and the seas are shaken. The rocks like wax melt before your glance. But to those who fear you, you are very merciful. Though the sweet odor of every sacrifice is a trifle, and the fat of all holocausts but little in your sight, one who fears the Lord is forever great. Woe to the nations that rise against my people. The Lord Almighty will requite them. In the day of judgment, He will punish them. He will send fire and worms into their flesh, and they shall burn and suffer forever. Glory to the Father and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. Who shall I glorify your name, O Lord? No one is able to snatch them out of the Father's hand. Ring out your joy to the Lord, O you jobs, for praise is fitting for loyal hearts. Give thanks to the Lord upon the harp, with a ten-string lute sing him songs. Who we'll sing him a song that is new, play loudly with all your skill, for the word of the Lord is faithful, and of all his works to be trusted. The Lord loves justice and right, and fills the earth with his love. By his word the heavens were made, by the breath of his mouth all the stars. He collects the waves of the ocean, he stores up the depths of the sea. Let all the earth fear the Lord, all who live in the world revere Him. He spoke and it came to be, He commanded it sprang into being. He frustrates the designs of the nations, He defeats the plans of the people. His own designs shall stand forever, the plans of his heart from age to age. They are happy whose God is the Lord, 
the people he has chosen as he so From the heavens the Lord looks forth. He sees all the children of men. From the place where he dwells he gazes on all the dwellers on the earth. He who shapes the hearts of them all and considers all their needs. A king is not saved by his army, nor a warrior preserved by his strength. A vain hope for safety is the horse, despite its power it cannot save. The Lord looks on those who revere him, on those who hope in his love. To rescue their souls from death, to keep them alive in famine. Our soul is waiting for the Lord, the Lord is our help and our shield. In him do our hearts find joy. We trust in his holy name. May your love be upon us, O Lord, as we place all our hope in you. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Free to worship him without fear, 
holy and righteous in his sight all the days of our life. You, my child, shall be called the prophet of the Most High, for you will go before the Lord to prepare his way, to give his people knowledge of salvation by the forgiveness of their sins. In the tender compassion of our God, the dawn from on high shall break upon us to shine on those who dwell in darkness and the shadow of death and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, to God who is, who was, and who is to come, now and forever. Amen. Dimite nobis domine, Devita nostra, Through the same Christ our Lord. Amen. 